All right, back. My camera's been recharged. Now we're out of focus. I tell you, it's rainy as hell out. Perfect day to make YouTube videos. Sorry, I gotta adjust the depth of the field here a little bit. There we go. Uh, more types of armor. Um, fantasy style armor. I'll show you. Um, I'll show you. I'll show you some armor that I had my ranger wear. Uh, patch. He's just a little bit like Wolverine. <laughs> Anyway, um, what I did with him was I gave him kind of like these awesome shoulder pads, but they have like this ripple, like these layers under effect uh, under them. I'm not sure what this is called. Maybe it's like abandoned male. I don't know. But then um, he, I would give him. That's what I would. I give him like ring mail. Yeah, and I would just make rings, and then I would attach the rings together, like so. And then his arms would be kind of open, exposed, I guess. And then I'd give him. Actually, you know what? I I would sometimes I'd give him a buckler shield. shield on the forearm there because he doesn't have like heavy armor. He's got some ring mail and some shoulder pads. And then he's got a skull. He's got a skull for the belt buckle as an homage to his old days of uh, being a pirate. So you just do a bunch of um, bunch of rings. And they don't have to be perfectly aligned because they're, they, they're kind of swaying. You know, I don't think they're necessarily tucked into his pants. They're just kind of like all just kind of hanging there together. Again, I, don't, I like to do actual research on this just to see how ring mail <laughs> kind of works. But again, sometimes you don't have access to the internet. And you just want to draw something on the fly. And, uh... Um, just, you know, play around with different armor ideas, different parts of the body uh, with armor on them. Uh, and you know, like a, he's got the big adventuring gloves, falcon gloves. I don't know if they're, they're called falcon gloves, but big old, big old gloves. And see, see that's not good because if he's holding a weapon there, it's going to, you know, now I'm forced to erase all this because it's blocking that skull. Good thing I drew it light, so it's not going to keep a long or a big, uh, line there All right Is this hand axe or uh, tomahawk or what however you want to say it let's see I have him kind of hunched over a little bit for his pants I would put plates over his um, outer thighs there and I'd kind of sometimes I just kind of round it off like they're long 
oval like shields that are strapped around his legs for a little extra protection. And then these pants would be either like a kind of leather or or just some kind of black or red pants, probably like a red. I like sporting the, the red pants and the and the black tunics and all that. Well yeah, that works. So you play around with it. Ooh, here's a little idea. Let's put a he has the, the skull motif. So I'll give him the put the skull on the shield I, on the, the buckler. I like it. I like it so much. And uh I'll give him up give me a give me the eye patch. And sometimes I have him with the ponytail. And I can give him like the little skull. Skull on the eye patch. Okay, if he wants to wear that one. We got a profile pick for D&D. &D. Love drawing that hair. Always fun. But, uh... And then, um... I think what I ended up doing, I put like little skulls on his and then just the design. Put some pings on it. You know. They're almost like football uh, shoulder pads. I like it. I think it's a lot of fun. It's not, you know, it's a sketch. I need to develop it a bit more, but that's another way to do some armor, some fantasy armor. All right. So don't say I didn't put out put out any content. So <laughs> there you go. Any ideas of what you want me to cover next? I might go back and just finish them up. The muscles and, and the more the details on, on the uh, ring mail. And uh, yeah. As always, you can check out my drawing course, 10 Second Cartooning. I'll throw that link up. I try to put that link there as much as possible. I've got a sale going on right now for uh, Udemy uh, programs, classes. All right, see you guys later.